what's up God's chosen people, otherwise known as Israel. You know, um, it's like Israel wrestled with God until God blessed it. You know, and it, it brings me to this place where that I experienced in my own life, and maybe you can relate it. Um, you know, I, I came to the message of the cross, and, and, and it was, no matter what you do, you go into heaven because of Jesus Christ crucified. And at the time, I mean, well, you know, even if, even if I'm, let me tell you something, eh? even if you're good, and you proclaimed yourself to be busy, uh, perfect without sin, it doesn't change the fact that you only go into heaven because of Jesus Christ crucified. Just by the way. So, in days where I felt like there was more chance to feel condemned, because I mean that's the enemy's entire plan was to make you feel condemned, and any reason for that. Um, you know, I was I was tested with this, where the enemy would say, but that's blasphemous. How does it give you the right to do the things you're doing and still say that you're forgiven? So I was in a struggle between salvation and condemnation constantly. And, um, but at the same time, whatever was going on in my life, I couldn't change. Believe me, I tried. I tried. <laughs> I really, really tried. But I couldn't change. And at the end of the day, I just got so fed up and I just said, you know what, God, I don't care. Uh, even if I die this way, even if you judge, I will still say that Jesus Christ crucified is enough. That's all I can do. That's all I can do. You know, God doesn't test you. I mean, if you were perfect, how would God test you on his message? You know, if you didn't sin, how would he test you on his message that Jesus Christ crucified is enough? I'm not saying that you must sin, don't get me wrong. I'm just saying... In times we are tested to feel judged and condemned, how much more will we still proclaim the cross is enough? Remain faithful unto me, even in death, and I will give you the crown of life, even in condemnation, even in judgment, and say that I am greater, and I shall give you the crown of life. So, if anything in your life doesn't feel like you know, um, uh, it's following through in any way, or you can't uh, um, get to that place where you, you can actually feel the certainty of it. Remain persistent, just like Israel did, and said, I will not stop seeking your face, and I will not stop believing that Jesus Christ crucified is enough until you bless me. Until you bless me. The change is not your responsibility. The trust is. I know that God is working in your life right now. I know that He's answering all your prayers. I know that He's removing all traps and snares of the enemy. I know that He's made all your paths straight. And I know that He leads you into paths of righteousness for His name's sake. I know that God loves you. And I know that He keeps His promises because that's who He is. In Jesus' name, Amen.